given the extenuating circumstances, I've been forced to produce videos out of my home for the foreseeable future, and since I have so much time on my hands now, I figured this would be a great opportunity to learn some of the essential life skills that come with residing in the CNMI for any extended period of time. Today we are starting with the absolute basics, how to make finadeni, a salty, sour, spicy sauce that we literally put on everything. I've never had to make it before because it was always on hand in my house. It was like tap water, I never had to worry about it, someone else always made it for me. But my time has finally come to learn the ancient secrets of this magical island potion. Oh, and before we proceed, I just want to make it very clear that this is not the definitive finadeni recipe. The ingredients and amounts vary by household, so it's very much catered to personal taste, and this recipe here is the one that I grew up with and love. If you have a different recipe, please leave it down in the comments because it might be better than mine. But I doubt it. I start off by slicing one fourth of a medium sized onion. I prefer to have rather large slices in my finadeni because I like the texture that the onion provides as well as the flavor, but it's also very common to dice the onion. Next up, I am finally dicing one clove of garlic. On top of the onions and garlic, I am pouring half a cup of soy sauce. And a fourth of a cup of vinegar. And lastly, the piece de resistance is half a teaspoon of hot pepper. Now this is the only thing I'm going to be very particular about. I highly suggest getting hot pepper from either Saipan Tinian or Rhoda because I've had finadeni before that utilize peppers that were not from there and it just doesn't have the same qualities. So if you can get your hands on some, please do. Give that a good and thorough mix. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, finadeni, the ketchup of the Marianas. The great thing about this is that all the flavors that are used are very, very basic. It's just salty, spicy, and sour. So it will really complement pretty much anything that isn't already too salty. We would love to know your favorite ways to enjoy finadeni, or if you're making this for the first time, we would love to know how that went. So please leave all that down below in the comments. And that's a wrap for today, everyone. Thank you so much for watching and please stay safe we are sending you good vibes and love always and forever. This We 670 production was made with generous donations from viewers just like you and with considerable help from my grandmother. So thank you very much, Grams, for ensuring this wasn't a complete failure. One fourth of this. A fourth of this. And one clove of garlic, Grams. One clove of garlic. Grams, I just need to know if it's a clove or not. I just need to know if it's one clove or not. Yeah, one clove. Half a teaspoon, right? So you want me to put in one fourth cup, okay? Yes. 